Hi, my name is Amanda, and I'm here to share a mindfulness practice that really helps me to explore what is filling up my mind space and to just get it all out from there and see how I'm feeling, what I'm focused on, and if that is serving me. And it also gives me an opportunity to say, hey, maybe I can change something here or there to better serve me. So I'm going to share this practice with you, and I hope that you find it useful. You can do this practice by yourself, or you can invite some family or friends to do it with you. All you need is to be in an environment where you feel comfortable, and you need some paper, whether that's blank or line paper. You can use a journal if that's your thing, and then you just need some writing utensils. So I have a pen and two markers representing my two favorite colors, purple and green, purple's first. Okay, so take some time to gather your materials and set up yourself, and we're going to do a little practice together. Let's begin by getting into a comfortable seated position, whether that's cross-legged or your hands are behind you and your feet are out in front so your legs are extended. Pick whatever is comfortable for you. Once you are in position, close your eyes or lower your gaze somewhere on the ground and we are going to take some time to observe our breath. Bring your attention to your breath. Notice your inhales and your exhales. What is the rhythm of your breath in this moment? Are you breathing quickly or slowly? Does it feel rigid or stuck? Maybe you notice your chest rise and lower or your belly expand and contract as it goes toward your spine as you inhale and exhale. Or maybe those sensations are a little numb or dull. You can't really feel those things and that's okay. We're just noticing what's happening in our bodies from moment to moment. Take a few more breaths to explore and notice these things. When you are ready, you can gently open your eyes or bring your gaze up. Okay, now we're gonna stretch a little. So on an inhale, we're going to lift our arms up over our head and just stretch, 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 and release the arms back down by your side. Okay, let's do it one more time. Lift them up, stretch, stretch, reach. Reach, reach, reach. Take another breath in and let it go. Release your arms. Okay, now we're going to do a seated cat and cow flow. So placing your hands on your lap or your knees. And on your next breath in, we're gonna raise our chest up and curve our spine and look up to the sky. And on an exhale, we're going to just round the back, bring your chin to your chest. Inhale coming up. And exhale, rounding the back, and bring your chin towards your chest. Continue to do a few more rounds of these. You can do this with your eyes open or closed. You can go as fast or as slow as you want. Let's do one more. Good. If your eyes are closed, gently open them up 
as you come back to a neutral position. So now, I would like you to get your paper and pens, and we are going to take some time to put all of our thoughts onto paper. You can do that by writing out your full thought, or just words that come to mind, or drawings, whatever feels right for you. And we're going to spend about three to five minutes to write or draw out all your thoughts, and the only parameter is that you don't stop writing or drawing. So even if it's writing, I don't know what I'm gonna say right now, so I'm just writing this, or drawing swirls and doodles, that's totally fine. But whatever is in your mind, take the time to just put it on paper, okay? So I'm gonna keep track of the time. Let's begin now. You have a couple more minutes. Okay, so use the next 30 seconds to a minute to finish up your last thought or picture. And if you need more time, you can always pause the recording and continue.
Okay. So now I'm going to give you time to look over what you wrote and just notice what you are observing. What's primarily on your mind? And try to do this without judgment. There's no right or wrong. It's just simply noticing what is taking space in your mind right now. Just review your paper, notice and be curious about what you're giving energy to and what your mind is focusing on. Where's your mind at? So you might notice that you are excited about certain things or you might notice thoughts of disappointment or that you're feeling grateful. Maybe you notice thoughts around something you find challenging. Just notice the types of thoughts that are on your page and any feelings you might be able to identify that go with that. You are welcome to write down the things you notice if you want, or circle some words that stand out to you. Okay, take some time to wrap up those last thoughts, observation, discoveries about what's currently on your mind. Now we are going to come back to a seated position if you are not already there and we're going to take a few moments to connect back with our bodies and our breath. Notice your legs, the base of your body connected with the ground. Lengthen your spine by sitting up tall, maybe roll your shoulders back and down. Gently close your eyes or lower your gaze again. Bring your attention back to your breath. Notice the rhythm of your inhales and your exhales. Maybe come up with a word for how you are feeling right now.
And as you stay there with your eyes closed or lowered, I'm going to read to you a quote. As I read this out to you, pay attention to how you are feeling, the thoughts that are arising from hearing, hearing this quote, and what just comes up. Being mindful of it. There's no judgment, just noticing. Your mind is like a piece of land planted with many different seeds, different kinds of seeds. Seeds of joy, peace, mindfulness, understanding, and love. Seeds of craving, anger, fear, hate, and forgetfulness. If you plant tomato seeds in your gardens, tomatoes will grow. Just so, if you water a seed of peace in your mind, peace will grow. When the seeds of happiness in you are watered, you will become happy. When the seeds of anger in you is watered, you will become angry. The seeds that are watered frequently are those that will grow strong. That quote is by Thich Nhat Hanh. So in hearing that, notice the thoughts that are present. And now bring your awareness back to your breath. Notice the rhythm. Is it moving quickly or slowly or rigid? And notice any sensations that may be arising in your body. So maybe there is a tightness in certain areas. Maybe there is warmth or coolness or tingling. What are the sensations you are feeling? When you are ready, I want you to slowly open up your eyes or bring your gaze up and get your second piece of paper out. I want you to think about what you would like to be focusing on. What seeds do you want to water? Write down at least three things you want your mind and your energy to be centered around. Maybe those are things like three things you are grateful for. Or you notice your mind is really focused on a certain thing and it has you feeling a certain way. So maybe decide to do a task that will help you feel at ease or accomplished, for example. It could be simply noticing I am feeling this way and I would actually like to feel this way instead. And I want to bring that type of quality into my day. So take some time to write about those things. I'll give you about three minutes. Please begin if you haven't already. So we are writing what we want our focus and energy to be on and how we want to feel.
Once you have written out, I would say, at least three things, take a look at all that you have written and pick one thing that you feel like, today, I want to focus on this. So maybe I want to focus on being kind or confident. Once you have picked your focus point, close your eyes and say that to yourself three times. Today, I'm going to focus on this. And when you have completed saying that, I just want to do one more check-in and notice how you are feeling right now. How are you feeling right now? You can close your eyes or lower your gaze and bring your awareness back to your breath. Noticing your inhales and your exhales. And when you are ready, you can gently open up your eyes. Thank you. Bye for now. This practice is being brought to you by Newly Foundation, a charitable organization that provides trauma-informed mindfulness and movement tools to youth within the justice system, under-resourced schools, and more as well as workshops and trainings for adults that support youth, such as educators and parents. To donate and support to our work, please go to www.newlyfoundation.com donate. Don't forget to follow us on SoundCloud and subscribe to our YouTube channel.